If anybody's ever wondered why I call them ghost clouds, that's why. Look at them. Don't they look like sheets with outstretched arms just reaching up going, woo, a big ghost flying over you because I'm dead and you will be dead soon too. Breathe me. Breathe deep. Right? Breathe it all up. Bypass the blood-brain barrier. Breathe deeply. I think I'll uh, slow down. Look at that bullshit. Yeah, that's what a cloud looks like. Okay. Makes a lot of sense. Heck, who'd ever question that? Nobody will as soon as this generation is dead. As soon as my generation of people are dead, none of the kids will know any different. That's a cloud. Airplanes make clouds. That's what they could teach them in school and they wouldn't know any fucking different. Can you believe that shit? Pardon my language. Yeah, ghost clouds. They're turning us into ghosts. It's freedom clouds. We're setting us free. Look up! Look at these guys, they're out jogging. They're getting healthy in the, in the poison spray. That's right, don't let that poisonous hair get you down. Just get your heart rate up. Get, you, get to breathing a whole bunch of it. That's real good for you, right? Uh, this is the one time where, with these kip shells, where smokers are probably better off. Because uh, they get the tar in their lungs, which will absorb some of the, the aluminum oxide, barium, and strontium nanoparticles and then that can actually be extruded from your body by natural processes whereas the aluminum barium strontium once it's breathed into your lungs into your bloodstream where it bypasses the blood brain barrier it then can collect up in your glands and your joints real effectively causing major arthritis issues it can, go right up under into your skin and become major psoriasis issues uh, it can really clog up your brain and become mental problems such as anxiety and Alzheimer's and schizophrenia and you name it any kind of mental disorder conceivable is either brought on or exacerbated by aluminum oxide right I mean this is simple stuff. It's not as if we don't know what these metal toxins do to people. We've known what these metal toxins do to people for hundreds of years. Duh. Nice Camaro. <laughs> and another nice Camaro. Woo. So anyway. Huh. So yeah, don't don't worry about um, tanker jets spraying neurotoxic substances into the atmosphere in an attempt to combat global warming. Don't don't worry about that because breathing neurotoxins all day long and all night long, every day and every night for years on end, that won't do anything to you. But there's a scary virus out there that's running around. You can't see it, but wear your mask or it'll get you. <laughs> 